So living wills are your directions in the event that something were to happen to you and you were to become incapacitated. So for instance, if you were to, God forbid, fall into a coma or if uh, dementia struck or if Alzheimer's came, on, came in, um, a living will is your is how you want to be treated both medically and on a personal level whether that be your diet uh, whether that be a do not resuscitate do we want artificial preservation of life do we want you to be walked regularly um, you know do you want a specific type of medication versus a different one and these living wills and standby guardianships allow them to prepare their proxies and their standby guardians that my child may have something and you need to be prepared and this is the type of medication that they may need to be on and same goes for the living will if a diabetic leaves a living will does not leave a living will and no one knows that they're a diabetic and they don't get to their medical records in time there they could be it could be fatal and these are the types of situations that again we stress for when we stress our plan ahead model.